We are going to download and install Android Studio 4.0 and install the Android emulator and configure the right SDK for our Android Studio and run our Hello World application. What's up guys and welcome to Master Coding channel and the complete Android developer course on Udemy. In this tutorial, we are going through installing and downloading Android Studio 4.0 and configuring it on the right SDK and the correct tools and running our first application on emulator. If this is your first time here and you want, you want to learn Android from zero to hero by building a real applications and publishing them on Play Store, you are on the right place. Hit subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit five stars on Udemy so you get the latest coupons, free coupons for our next projects. Let's begin downloading and installing Android Studio. In the first step, we go to the Google and add Android Studio. And we select this, or we can go to the, uh, to the studio developer.android.com slash studio. So also we can select this first. I close this. So the link is developer.android.com slash studio. So here we go. We have Android Studio 4.0 for Windows 64 bit and uh, the Android uh, website will detect your, uh, your, um, your uh, Windows um, settings and give you the best approach and the best uh, SDK for, uh, for, you, uh, for a setup files for your Windows. This is Android Studio 4.0. Okay. And I will click on download. I have read and agree with the above terms and conditions and download Android Studio. So we, we will uh, uh, wait for the download. So if you want to learn Android Studio and Android app development from zero to hero and build applications and publish applications on Play Store, you are on the right channel. So click, uh, click subscribe uh, below and uh, you will get the latest tutorials and the complete Android developer course is for free. You can learn Android from zero and we are updating every day our courses on Udemy and uh, on Android uh, and on master channel, uh, master coding channel. So uh, you are welcome to subscribe and join our family to get the latest courses and coding tutorials. Here we go. We click on open. Waiting the windows, the setup file. Here is the installer. Okay, I will click yes. Click next and add here the tick for Android virtual devices. Okay, so next Android Studio and create shortcut and waiting for the installation uh, file. We click on next. We click on start Android Studio. Let's close this and here we go. We have the Android Studio. I will close the project because I have a set up files for the previous one. And I will go to the configure and SDK manager. Here is the SDK manager. So Android needs the SDK for in order to uh, Android Studio need SDK in order to configure the files to run and to add the latest libraries that we they need. So we go and select the latest one, which is Android R preview, not installed. And Android 10, because I have the previous version of Android Studio and the SDK files is uh, uh, found. But till now, I will select this. I will select this and it is uh, update available. Okay, never mind. I will click on apply changes. 
here we go the following component will be installed which is the latest one android r i click ok and waiting for downloading platform and here we go so guys uh, uh android studio is the best ide used for developing uh, android uh, applications and java applications but for for our uh, our uh, uh, for our uh, experiences uh, we uh, prefer uh, and recommend using uh, uh, this ide because it's very professional now the android r preview is installed now i will go to the android 10 q and show a uh, click on show package details so show package details I have installed the R and I have previously installed the Q. We need to install the R because it is the latest one. So for that, we see that there is no Android SDK platform uh, and source for Android 29 and many things that are not uh, found in this because it is a preview. So. We need to configure and update the latest, the latest one for uh, for um, our applications and Android Studio. So for that, I will install this. Installed resource for Android twenty nine is installed also, and update available Google API. This is Atom system image. And here we go, it is here. So I click on apply, accept, and waiting for Android to start downloading because it is 1.1 gigabyte. After finishing, click on finish. And uh, let's see the SDK you update sites and all checked. Okay, till now remove the show packages installed and also there is an update available show package details and here we go i have installed this so back to the uh, plugins i have installed the plugins the carbon and the material theme ui and the dart and flutter there is also update you can update them so let's now configure our avd android virtual devices so create a virtual device and click on i will select pixel 2 because it's 1080 and 19 times 1920 i click on next i will download the latest release sdk released api so i will click on download and click on accept and next so we see that we have previously installed this but i have uh, canceled it because i'm making the video so um, till now i will wait for downloading the r04 which is the r sdk and the image for our emulator so I will wait for downloading this image for our Android uh, virtual device. So when completing the installation request components, click on a finish. And here we go. We select the SDK, click next and AVD name, APR, APIR and click finish. Here we go. This is the virtual device and we click on run okay starting the avd and we click on close and we can wait for running this android uh, emulator in this time uh, we click on start a new android studio project we have bunch of a bunch of options we click on empty activity we click on hello world this is the name of application the package name the save location and the language you can select kotlin or java i will select java i prefer using java because it is a native of android 
and we click on finish here we go we have starting the android studio and we have starting the emulator in the same time this is the emulator and congratulations this is our new emulator okay so uh, and back to android studio this is the android studio and also i have created the uh, or installed the plugin for uh, the theme so we click on tools you can uh, see the tools the refractors the file edit and navigation file and there is a a new uh, video or a complete video on the anatomy of the android studio uh, program so waiting for the gradle bolt model we're still waiting for this to in order to complete so we can edit the codes so this is the main activity uh, java file and this is the xml files so guys it's very important to learn android studio if you want if you are looking to publish and create android applications and benefit from admob and making uh, paid applications or uh, using uh, the advertisements so you get money and uh, also you can create free apps and uh, i hope you benefit from our videos uh, so um guys if you want to learn android as i told you click on uh, subscribe below to get the latest tutorials on youtube channel or rate us five stars on udemy and get latest coupons and the latest tutorials so guys let's run our first application this is the application we click on run using and selecting the pixel to api r the uh, the recently created uh, uh, emulator and we see in the bar here launching the activity and amazing guys this is our one billion dollar application just kidding i hope you subscribe like and comment on youtube i ha i hope you to uh, uh, uh and advise you to rate us five stars to get the latest tutorials and the coding videos coupons for uh, Udemy. Thank you. See you next videos. Video.